Hi everyone, maybe you guys don't know that, but I am a huge Johnny Depp fan. I have not watched all of his movies, but I still have a lot of them on DVD, so I'm gonna do a quick little review on them. And some of the movies I have done a deeper review on, but I, I'm, I am just not gonna, I'm not gonna do do some so much deeper review on the stories in these movies. I, maybe I, I, I'm just gonna focus most on Johnny Depp's performance here. So the main focus here and I'm also gonna say that I have seen some movies with him like Corpse Bride for example but I do not have that one on DVD but however I'm gonna do a really quick review on, on Johnny Depp's performances on some movies that I have here on DVD alright guys so first I'm gonna start with the Pirates movies and I'm not gonna take them one by one because he, if because I see he's playing like the same character here I, I don't think we get too much differences here so I'm, I'm just going to say what I think overall of Johnny Depp as Captain Jack Sparrow. I think he 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 looks absolutely stunning as Jack Sparrow with all the clothes and the details. Uh, how we really get to see this event in your side of Johnny Depp here is absolutely amazing. And how this is like his biggest break for like worldwide and for Disney. That is just amazing. And I think kind of in the sequels that we get to see the, the more fun side than the deeper side on the care. But I still feel like that there are some scenes that we still get some deep, and that's great. So yeah, that, that's pretty much what I have to, to say about this character. I think the character is fun, it's interesting, and he looks just absolutely stunning. So you guys, it's not in any specific order, but yeah, that, that was first those. And I was gonna take a look at the, <clears throat> at the Alice in Wonderland movies. There he is. So, so, so here we have Alice in Wonderland and Alice for the Looking Glass as well. And here, here we, we can still talk about some differences here. I think Johnny John Depp is absolutely gorgeous as, as the Mad Hatter. And, and, and of course this is one of his great collaborations with Tim Burton. This is Tim Burton's take on Lewis Carroll's Alice in Wonderland. So it definitely has that like darker tone. But, it's, but, it's, but I think it's stunning. I think Johnny Depp looks gorgeous as Mad Hatter. He looks very whimsical. And, but he also has a lot of deep... On the character that is very surprising, I absolutely like that. And here in the second movie, I, I think Hattie is m pretty much more like a more like a charming character than an extremely deep in character in in the first movie. But I still think that that that, that, that we still that he still is a very interesting character. That's great. Hmm. Right, this is this is a childhood kind of kind of childhood family, or like teen early teenage favorite for me. This is Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, and and and, and, and I think Johnny Depp looks so so hot in this movie. I just love how his makeup looks so simple, and still it looks so amazing because you, it's so hard. It's kind of hard to understand that it is Johnny Depp playing Willy Wonka. I just love it. I love how how he he is both kind of quirky, but but also is. Is very deep, so so that's pretty much what we get out of this character: fun and deep at the same time, a little bit evil, but at the same time incredibly interesting in my opinion. Oh, right, this one is special. This is Johnny Depp as Wango. So this is very special. This is one of the movies that he has done a voice, just as the same as in Court Sprite. He he is the voice at, as Wango here, and yeah, I really like this this movie. I think it's just so fun to. To have a movie where Joy Depp is doing a voice in my collection, I just I, I think he's super cool as Wango, and for me who who kind of likes the Wild Western Django, even though I haven't seen much of it, I still kind of like it. I think it's very fun and adventurous, and and Wango is definitely fun and pretty adventurous. So we really like how 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 Joy Depp are doing a voice of of a character that kind of discovers self discovery. However, so maybe he isn't super adventurous, but he still gets some kind of self-discovery in this story. He's like a kind of outsider character, but, but I really like this kind of story. I think it is beautiful. The animation is gorgeous, and Johnny Depp's voice acting here is absolutely perfect. Hmm. Alright, you guys are going to love this one. Edward Scissorhands. I think this movie is absolutely beautiful. So this was definitely Johnny Depp's first collaboration with Tim Burton. So, and, and yeah. I definitely think this this is such a beautiful, beautiful story about about being who you are and just and 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 just 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 having having the 
do it the, the right of it. Uh, can I express yourself in your creativity and character? Because in this movie, we kind of see it's a little different on the character here, but but he, he's just so sweet and innocent and nice. And I think yeah, that does an absolutely beautiful job just just deliver the message, deliver the character in this movie, and 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 how he does the story without needing to like say so many words that's just beautiful and his way and i also love his way how he can just balance stuff with these kind of scissor hands things that is just how he can balance the scissor hands that's just amazing this is another one that i really like sleepy hollow so i did not watch this movie when it came out i guess i was too little for it but i have what just did on dvd however yeah so so i i think jordan looks absolute this i think he looks so hard in this movie and and, and and that's understandable. He 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 is, because he was very young here. But but I absolutely love him as this kind of detective character in this movie. I think he is just so cool and still like, pretty humble and gentle. I think, but but at the same time he is very very you know, active on what he's doing. But there are also some kind of fun scenes. I really love how he how 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 about this kind of gentle and fun and. And like suicides are coming coming out of these characters. I just love this movie so much. I think it's beautiful. Alright you guys, this is for your musical lovers out there and this is my favorite. I guess you, you if you guess for me on, on my channel you probably know which movie I'm talking about. That's right, Sweeney Todd. That's my absolutely favorite movie of all your depth movies. I think he is just absolutely perfect as this character. He does such an amazing job just delivering this complicated character and that he also this is the first movie where he sings it's amazing i think i think he he, he has a beautiful voice it's not perfect but it's beautiful it's very fitting for the character uh, and you can really hear that he really can can just bring out just as great emotions through singing as he's acting all right the last dvd in my collection is dark shadows and and yeah, here here Johnny Depp is playing a vampire, which is very cool to see. I think this movie is very cool. I I like to see Johnny Depp as a as a as a vampire. And I seen all of the movies. I used to love how Johnny Depp can wear so much makeup and just make everything so perfect. And this is no exception. I think he is absolutely looks absolutely gorgeous with this makeup. And he does such a great job bringing this character Barnabas Collins to. To life, some people may may not like it because maybe the, he's this character isn't completely accurate to the original um, Dark Shadows TV show. But but and I haven't seen it, so I can't really compare that. But however, if we just think about Johnny's performance, I think think he just does a just does a beautiful job, and and you just kind of falls in love with this kind of dark but still interesting character. So yeah, that was my review on, on my Johnny Depp movie collection, especially at least my review on on what I think about Johnny Depp's performances on, on all these movies. So, so, so this is definitely a proof of how what a great actor he is, and he he's still one of my absolutely favorite actors. So, you guys, hope you like this review, and don't forget to like and subscribe and leave us a comment below. Bye, everyone.